than you were. He was as fit as any horse I've had at a four star. And he gave me a wonderful ride cross country. My only re regret um, for the whole day was that possibly from a competitive point of view, he was so well within himself that I could have asked for a little bit more and he felt extremely comfortable uh, the whole way and had plenty of fuel left in the tank at the end. I'm obviously devastated about what's happened and but really I wanted to state that I, I felt that uh, the course was a very good course, it was a very good test and it, I would be very sad if anybody was to uh, draw any incorrect conclusions and feel that the tough testing nat nature of the competition in any way uh, contributed towards what happened because from the feel I had on the horse it wasn't connected. My, I'd also like to take the opportunity to thank the organisers and the vets on site who are um, extremely professional and to know that although these things are terrible, the horse in no way suffered and it was all extremely quick. Thank you. The network. Wonderful horse, um, who I've ridden since he was a four-year-old. He's. I, I said when he was a six-year-old to my father that I felt that one day he would be considered to be the best cross-country horse in the world, and I think he probably was. He gave me a wonderful ride around badminton earlier this year to finish third in similar conditions. And today he felt like he was cross-country schooling the whole way around. He felt totally normal and perfect until the moment I got off him. So I had nothing to add um, other than he felt 100%.